All right, so I just finished recording the last video. This will be going up tomorrow the 13th, but here we go. We're back with Black Ops. Don't you morons get it? If you think your government-sponsored brutality intimidates me, you clearly don't know anything about Dragovich. I have nothing to gain by talking to you. Think about what you have to lose. We can do this all day. We got plenty of windows. Or you can give us what we want and we guarantee your safety. <laughs> I'm already a dead man. I've been hunted across every corner of the globe. If you found me, so will they. They know everything you know. They're probably on their way now. Why? Dragovich doesn't like loose ends. I've never even dealt with him directly. Only Steiner, the German. What was the nature of your business? I was hired to help stabilize certain volatile. What kind of compound? Nova 6. A biochemical weapon. You let them right through me! Get your head down! I was gonna have to listen to this guy again. Once your escape route, there's a hatch in the ceiling. This way. Did you inhale the gas? What the hell does this guy do? To the roof! I think I actually get an achievement for not using any other weapon other than these. So what I could do is just uh, John Wick this uh, this mission. Let's go ahead and try that. At least challenge ourselves. prepared for a dead man just because I accept the inevitability of my fate does not mean I'm in any hurry to embrace it whatever you say English okay on me target down enemy down another confirmed contact down What the fuck? Get the cover! What the? <laughs> what the hell is that guy doing? Dude, what's up with this freaking frame rate? Shit. Oh, 
I wish I had ammo. Oh, uh, this pain is gonna be. Garbage is going to a lot of trouble to shut you up. What are you not telling us? I told you about Nova 6. Where is their base? Nam? Laos? Cambodia? We come down. Sent in a cleanup crew to steal what's left of my research. Well, no, thank you, Dragovich. I can clean up my own mess. <laughs> ah, either of you too low on ammo? We still have a ways to go. This way! Uh... What's that guy doing? A, using a freaking sniper close range. Target down. Confirmed. I see them. Out the roof. Reload. Go, go. Contact down. That's confirmed. Hold position here. Holy shit. My luck, I would have fell off this damn thing. I know, I pressed A. I promise you I pressed A. That's bull. That's 
what happens when you fucking talk too much. <laughs> Just the icing on the cake. Double trouble. Only use only dual wield weapons to escape Kowloon. Yeah. What the hell? Where are we headed? Clark ID a Nazi scientist. Working for Dragovich. Still, buddy. His name's Steiner. We're going to Russia, Mount Yamatown. Broken English. We know that Jason Hudson briefed you on the intel extracted from Dr. Clark and Kowloon. Hudson said that Clark was insane, paranoid, fixated with numbers. Clark created Nova 6, a nerve toxin that can rupture a body in seconds. Dragovich is second in command. Krevchenko tested in Vietnam. On them? On us? On his own? <laughs> he doesn't care. Vokuda. Reznov told me at Vokuda. What did he tell you? Mason, listen to me. It was a long time ago. Far away. Dragovich, Stein, Krajenko, all must die. But he told me what they did. What kind of men they were. Why they all must die. They all must die. Oh, this is that mission where we go to the North Pole or whatever. My father was a musician in Stalingrad. During the German occupation, the sound of his violin filled the air with magnificent music. Corsico, Stasso, many of the great nationalist composers. To my countrymen, it was a symbol of hope. To I'll the be Germans, back. Give him some food. It was a symbol Somebody. of defiance. Even now, his music still haunts me. The Nazi slit his throat while he slept. Collaborating with any Nazi is a betrayal, a betrayal against all of Mother Russia. Dragovich, Krushenko were not troubled by such matters. They look only to advance their own interests and agendas. Uh, yep, there's that one mission where we are in the Arctic Circle. Everything is loaded. They are waiting. Victor, it is time. Yes, Dimitri. Time to hunt down the last remnants of the fascist Reich. Nevsky, grab the gear. We are moving out. The men and I have fought through the most bitter of winters on the Eastern Front. We were no strangers to cold, even now. The blood in my veins chills when I think back to the events of that day. Far, far. Ah! The hero of Berlin graces us with his presence. Have you not tired of battle, Reznov? As long as Mother Russia has enemies, I will answer her call. Put aside your petty rivalry, Kravchenko. Captain Reznov will do as he is told. We are here for one German, and one German only, Dr. Friedrich Steiner. This man has offered his cooperation to our cause. He is not to be harmed. Please obey this order. 
You will be shot. What happened in Stalingrad, between you and Dragovich? When the German occupation began, he and his lapdog, Krachenko, left my men and I hopelessly outnumbered. Promises of reinforcements were made. Made, but not kept. Dragovich and Krachenko are opportunists, manipulators. They are not to be trusted, Dmitri. Dmitri Petrenko was one of the bravest men I have ever known. He fought by my side from the siege of Stalingrad to the fall of Berlin. The wounds he sustained, ensuring our victory should have earned him a hero's welcome to Russia. But Stalin had little need for heroes. The German must not be harmed. We need Steiner alive. Now move, both of you. Let's go. It is good to fight for your side once more. Yes, my friend. One final victory. Search every corner of this camp. Only stand to be spared. Mura! Let's go, buddy. What the hell? Dude, dude freaking ducked and freaking pulled out a freaking homing missile. Where, where, where was that grenade? Like, it was just following me? Like, come on, dude. Fuck off. Do not let them. <laughs> Committing war crimes. Push on my face. Clear the next area. Crash all who stand in our way. Where the hell did this guy come from, dog? Get away from me. Good job! Be careful! There may be more of them! He is not here! They must be closer to the ship! Get out. Spread out. Search every building. I see them in the 
What the hell happened to that guy? Holy shoot. Oh my god, explore uh, come on man, exploding barrels now, what's next? A fucking Come on man. Was that time again? I'm about to fucking teleport myself to fucking World War II. Alright, let's get rid of that fucking barrel. Fucking nuclear bomb. Bro, why am I over the apartment? I know I'm like the main character, but fuck, man. I hate these people. I hate all of you people. I hate all of you. He will be where all cowards reside, as far away from the battlefield as possible. I think that's good. After this mission, do you think we will go home? I hope so, Dimitri. I hope so. Yeah, it just fucking take like five years to reload a damn weapon. <laughs> the way I guy was like running across the room it looks so disgusting. Good mother Russia. You just realized why in the hell do I have freaking vibration on? Who the hell's the vibration? Shit's annoying. Oh, here it is. Fucking blind as hell. Frederick Stein. Do not point that weapon at me, Russian dog.
You will take me to Dragorich. As I looked into the German's eyes, I saw all the evil of the fascist Reich still burning strong. At that moment, every fiber of my being yearned to put an end to his wretched life. But I was a soldier then. I still believed in orders. Reznov, bring your men! What is here that is so important? General Dragovich wishes to make a name for himself. He believes this outpost houses something of great value to the motherland. Dragovich and Steiner are talking like old friends. I do not like this, Reznov. No, I do not. We must hurry on your guard. There are Germans who would sooner see you destroyed than captured. You assured me there would be no problems. I cannot control the actions of the SS, General Dagovich. They are sworn to defend the Reich till their last breath. Noble, but futile. Dravchenko, finish up here. Reznov, you and your men will lead the way. Yes, sir! Petrenko, Vikarev, Nevsky, follow! We are moving out! Steiner, tell me more about your association with the Gift Tiger Sturm project. In 43, the Fuhrer realized the Allies could not be held back for much longer. We began to look for more unconventional solutions throughout the war. My own research was focused on chemical weapons. It was meticulous and frustrating work. However, what we finally developed was a weapon more effective than we had ever dared to imagine. The weapon now housed within this vessel. No more seeds. chemical may be, you still have to find a way to unleash it. Long-range V2 rockets to be launched from this outpost. The targets were command and control centers. Washington, D.C. was our first target. Then Moscow. Hmm. Ambitious and commendable, Herr Stein. But we were too late. The British were upon us, and their bombers crippled the ship. Locked in the ice, we tried to salvage what we could. But it was too late. Germany had surrendered, and a Russian flag flew over Berlin. The SS had orders to destroy the ship if we were attacked. Clearly, they failed. The explosives were never activated. This is it. Reznov, open the door. We had found what we were looking for. Mother Six. The German weapon of mass destruction now belonged to Mother Russia. Or so it seemed. Our victory was to be short-lived. Dragovich wanted to see the effects of the poison firsthand. It was also an opportunity to remove a thorn in his side. I had long known of their distrust. What kind of men they were. It was a betrayal. I should have foreseen. Dmitry Pantrenko was a hero. He deserved a hero's death. Instead of giving his life for the glory of the motherland, he died for nothing. Like an animal. He should have died in Berlin.
As I watched my closest friend die, it became clear we were not the only ones seeking the German weapons. The Western Allies circled like vultures. Of course, Dragovich, Kroshenko, and Steiner scattered like rats, leaving me to contend with the British. British commandos assaulting our positions! We will plunge this vessel into the depths of hell. We cannot let either side possess this terrible weapon. I was so confused for a minute, I was like, wait, what? Keep moving! This is not our war! Everyone! We stand alone! from falling into the hands of the British. But I was a fool to think that the threat was over. It was only after I was captured and sent to Volkuder that I learned of Dragovich's true intentions. He would die before he gives up on Nova Six. Trust your leaders to destroy it? Or do you think they will use it? The flag may be different, but the methods are the same. They will use you as they used me. You must decide. Decide what you think is worth fighting for. Dragovich, Kravchenko, Stein. These men must die. Hudson's mission in Kowloon was accomplished. He had discovered Dragovich's endgame, Nova 6. The nerve docks are so deadly that if exposed, you'd be dead before you hit the floor. Dragovich's weapon. Go back to Vietnam, Mason. Was Victor Reznov still with you after you escaped from the back the compound? <sighs> Reznov was with me the whole time. Are you sure? North. We went north. Viet Cong. We were shot down, and Reznov even survived that. Dragovich's lapdog Krevchenko was there. He knew we'd come. Alright, well... This is where this episode ends. This is um, Hotel Le I'm gonna end it here. There we go. Good, uh... Quite fun hour to play this game. Uh, I will be finishing it, like I said in the last video, and a bunch of other plans. Go check that out. Um, I think we're 
Eh, we're almost done with this campaign. Uh, honestly, like I said, man, this is one of my favorite Call of Duty games of all time. Uh, it'll always be, it'll, it would always have a special place. Personally, for me, this is my Black Ops 2 right here. Just Black Ops from the multiplayer to the campaign to the zombies to the friendships. Everything about this game is just uh, is perfect for me. But anyways, I'll catch you guys on the next one. As always, you guys take care. Um, yeah. Later. Whoa. Why is my mouse lagging really bad? There we go. All right, later.